Hello, singers. I'm going to work with you uh, on Italian vowels. Um, it's very useful when uh, you have to approach an Italian uh, aria or any kind of song that you would like to learn in Italian to uh, know how to pronounce the vowels, which are very easy. Uh, first of all, forgive my English. <laughs> then, um, uh, we just have a few vowels. We don't have many A's or many uh, O's. We just have a few vowels. So we can count them on our fingers. It's E, which is a very E, very straight, you know. We don't have E. It's E, E, out of the teeth. E, E, E. These are two E's. Why are, while our E is a I for you. So if you have to write it, it's an I, but we pronounce it E, E. Your E is our A. So we have it. We have two E's. We have A and A. A, A. A, A. So we have E, A, A. Then we have the A. We just have one A in Italian, which is A. A. Like uh, rosa, rosa, which is the rose, rosa, a, ah, a. Ah. We just have, we just have this one. We don't have others. It's just a, ah, not a, ah, or a, ah, or other things, or a, or other. It's a. Ah, that just that. So we have our the your I is our e e. Then you have the e. Your e is we have two, and it is a and a. Like, I don't know, for example, um, le, le, le rose, the, le rose. And then here we have, e, e, sempre, sempre, certo, certo, certo. These are e, e. Then a, a, which is your a, okay? Now we have two o's, o's. O, o, like uh, orto, orto. Oppure, or, <laughs> or, o, the other one. We have two, two o's. We have o, e, o, o, e, o, o. So, uh, then, last one is the u, which is, which is u, u, u. Okay, so, let's pronounce them all together. E, 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 a, o, o, u. E, 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 A, O, O, U. Very well. So, if we have to do it with consonants, which is very important because you know that consonants are the most important part of the word in order to understand it, to hear it. We sing on the vowels, but consonants make them understood better. Of course, you have to think the vowel in the correct way. You have to think, if you have to pronounce an A in Italian, you have to, to think A, ah, A. Ah. You have to have it in your mind, very, um, I mean, record it in your mind. So, you have to say an A with M, so ma, ma in Italian. It is ma, 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 you do it. Go.
the same thing with the T, which in Italian is a T, 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 not T, 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 it's T, 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 T. The tongue on your palate, but not bursting, it's not T, T, it's T, 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 very dry sound. So it's da, 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 da. sounds like rrr, like in Spanish so you will have to, you have to practice it a little bit because it's you can use it on just on the beginning of the of the of this exercise so you won't have to repeat it too many times just practice it in the beginning of the of the of the exercise so of the vowel changes a little bit but you have to have it in your mind when you know how uh, which is the sound of the, of the vowel then it is right you can do it right because the body knows how to do it if you have practiced it and if you speak the language if you don't speak the language you have to practice a lot so I'll try and help you out with this I will do my best to, to help you out with the pronunciation even if you don't really, really, really speak Italian, you can help yourself a lot just practicing, practicing. Many singers have to, to, to sing in many different languages and they cannot speak them all. So we try and do our best. So now the other one we have to practice is the D, D, because we don't have the D, 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 down, down. We don't say that. We say in Italian, if you hear in Italian speaking English, it says down, down, down. <laughs> this is how we say the D, 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 D. So, da. Da, you. Da. example it's very difficult to learn how to speak English because we don't have these vowels you have and you have many and for us it's very difficult to pronounce them and uh, so please forgive me um, but um, we just have one E and the E is straight like that E E very like that I don't know very it's, it cuts the air <laughs> so uh, it's not B it's not uh, it's Ri, ri. And it's very difficult to sing it 
because uh, um, you cannot really when you speak Italian then you you usually uh, push the voice a little bit too much because you want to pronounce it as it has to be pronounced in the, in the spoken language but we just use the technique as you do which is probably right and uh, um, and try and think about the pronunciation the, the correct pronunci pronunciation so it's kind of Think about a e e like c c, which is a um, c. It's kind of um, sorry. Um, I'm sorry. They calling me. I didn't turn off the phone. Forgive me. And um, so it's uh, yes. We say yes. You say yes. We say c c. Say it. C c. Assolutamente c c. C. Okay, so we say it. We say this e with uh, uh, other the other uh, consonants that we were talking about. So it's uh, it was r d t. Okay, so you don't push the e out of the mouth. You just say it, it's right. Say 
my se se if se. So we say e e, which is your e. Careful, you write it. Uh, it's a e e. <laughs> okay, so e se vero, which is the true. Okay, it's true. It's true. Eh, vero. Okay, e e e e. Okay, careful. We have two e's in Italian. E and e. We are doing the e, the first one. Quindi, so. Uh, well, well, it was, it was, it was, um, um, de, 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 sorry, de, 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 de,